Okay, so I'm going to show you a, a demo of the Network Sims web package. This is me. You'll find it should run on virtually every device that you have, but this is me running on an iPad just now. So if you press Cisco here, and then you should be able to, to go to your these series of challenges or to the actual device. So in this case, we're just using a router and uh, we'll just get logged in and config t and the host name okay we can put the question mark in and in this case it's thursday there we go okay then you should be able to just touch the screen and it'll give you the challenge and also for the the details of the of the device Okay, so that's the uh, the iPad version, but it should work just the same if you're using an Android device. It's obviously easier if you have a keyboard with it. I've just got a keyboard on, on, on my iPad here, so it works quite well. But you should find it works quite happily with inside Firefox. Also with uh, Chrome. So let's have a look at Chrome. So you should find each of the simulators are color coded. The router is the black one there. Okay. And Safari. And Firefox. Okay. So give you a quick demo with inside Firefox. Okay, so we'll just get enabled. So the tab should work. Okay, and then we can type in our commands. And in this case, put in that. And then we'll go into the first interface. Set our IP address again. You can you can try the question mark anytime. Two hundred dot ninety dot one one six dot two and a subnet mask of two five five two five five two five five one two eight. Okay, and then we'll do a no shutdown and we'll do our description. There's the speed of the interface. I'll make it 10 megabits per second and the duplex. Let's make that full duplex. Okay, so anytime you can actually have a look at the challenge and see what the commands should be. You can obviously use the show running config. Okay, and that will give you an idea of what you've actually set for the for the device. Okay, so each time it will show if you're correct or not. Each time you run it, you'll get a new challenge to to run. So we'll just show that. So you can see here different host name that we have them. Okay, so each one is color coded. So this, the red one is the switch emulator. Okay, there we go, tab, tab again, and host name, West Virginia. Okay, so it should work just the same as we've seen before. And there's the details there. I think you should be able to go up and down and with the arrow keys to, to recall your commands again. Okay, see that. And then we we'll use our hostname one again. And that works. 
אוקיי. Then we have a Cisco Ethernet. It's an interesting one to configure because it uh, actually has different interfaces. It has E0 and D0. D0 is the is the radio interface. Uh, I can do no shutdown on that one. What it also has is a BVI interface. Oh, so BV, which is our virtual interface. Oops, BVI one, and we can set the IP address. This is where we set the IP address for the device because it's a layer two device. And we have this is our virtual interface. And two five five two four eight zero dot zero. Okay, we can set our description again. Okay, and then you can go into E zero, your Ethernet port, and we can do an off shutdown on this one. Okay, so as previously defined, we can look at the help to give us the commands that we should be using. And so the next one we'll look at is the PIC CSA. It's much the same. Oops. Host name is Ireland. There we go. That one's correct. And we can go in and we can start to configure our address here to a four dot fifteen dot twenty dot six two five five two five two five five two five four oops should be two two four okay and then we have Juniper there's a host simulator and so on. And then once once you've got used to the simulator, then there are a whole lot of challenges that you can take. So in this case, we can look at the CCNA. So with inside the CCNA, there's a whole lot of challenges with inside there. So let's have a look at uh, the this one here for router management. Okay, so each challenge You'll find some details on it to give you a basic explanation of it. And this, the command should be there for you to complete that. Okay, so for something like the wireless part of it, there are some lectures that you can complete. And then there's a whole range of uh, different challenges that you would do on the actual device. So there we go. There's one there on uh, the, the Mac, MAC address filtering. Along with that, there's a whole lot of tests that you can actually take. So if we try the wireless one again, a test here okay and then you can complete this test and then hopefully at the end of it it will give you some idea about what you got correct and what you got wrong some of them will, might have some feedback there too uh, that you can actually complete Okay, so there's also Juniper simulators and so on. Okay, so 
Also, there's a Windows package if you want to use the Windows package. Uh, and there are a whole range of other things, such as voice, that you can try. And these should fit in with the, uh, with the certification.